Hi, you guys. Uh, so, I'm so excited to be doing a little, a popping, a loud, a colorful look for y'all today, okay? It's somewhat to talk through. Not really, because uh, I am going to fast forward some parts. I just don't want it to be so long. But, yes, y'all, okay? So, I'm doing a loud look. I'm back to my loud looks. I love, like y'all know, I love these spring colorful look so i had to go back into the goddess palette oh, i love it so much for my greens okay and my pinks and yeah i hope you guys enjoy much love to you all hey you guys so i'm doing the intro i don't know if i'm gonna end up deleting this tonight but Sometimes I end up, especially when I have somewhere to go, I end up forgetting or getting distracted and not being able to do my intro. So, hey, y'all, thank you so much for uh, coming. I'm just trying to get rid of this little shine, whatever. For uh, watching my video, I'm going to do my little quick tutorial and head out. So, I'm starting out with transition for my brows as well as this um, Real Techniques brow brush that I'm always using, always. All right, so next I'm going to blend out my brows. And next, I will be using my Born This Way Concealer in the shade Butterscotch to, you know, to do uh, sculpt my brows and highlight. And I will be using my long uh, square brush from my last brow, uh, my last pencil collection, y'all. I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, I feel like it is such a good thing that I don't. Although I can at times, I typically um, try not to do a billion makeup collections. You know, I have to remind myself, girl, you are one person. And a lot of these corporations got hundreds, if not thousands, even some of these celebrities got hundreds, if not thousands of people working for them. Okay, so I'm going to use my little chunky brush to blend everything out and i'm just so tired y'all i do everything every job the buyer <laughs> the assistant the photographer the model the uh tech person like everything and although i know there are other people that do everything for their business too that does not mean I can't say that I am tired, I am tired, boss, I am tired. Okay, so 
I'm going to do the other side and then I'm going to come back. All right, y'all. So obviously this is what I'm wearing for my shoot today. Y'all know, oops. <laughs> y'all know my theme is queen, obviously, because I'm coming out with a new collection of clothes or clothing boutique or whatever y'all want to call it. Queen Pen Boutique. So my birthday theme for this year is fully queen. Okay. So um I think I'm gonna go in a King James book. <clears throat> oh yeah so all of my little photo shoots are well not all of them i can't say that they all will be related to that but a lot of them will be i'm going to use this uh neutral shade here to start off my look for today and i'm going to go into my blending brush from the garden of eden collection get rid of my little protector Okay, y'all. I know the last shade was Okay, up. so I know the last shade was a nude type shade, but I'm doing that. I'm going to go on the Goddess palette because I'm wearing green and I don't want it to be like crazy looking. So I'm going to go into... I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and do all three. I'm going to start with this lightest shade at the bottom, move into this one, and then uh, go into the darkest green for all of the death that I could dream of. Oh, this feels so awesome, y'all. I haven't been, uh, if you haven't noticed, doing any colorful looks in so long. Like, <laughs> but I guess it's just like, I want to be able to do it fully, 100%. I don't want to be half-assing, especially since this is my favorite thing to do. Okay, y'all. So, next I'm going to go into my Born This Way concealer in the shade Snow. And I am going to use... This round tip brush by BH Cosmetics.
Okay, so now I'm going back into the uh, Goddess palette. <laughs> and I'm going to use this light pink shade on my lids. And um, I'm going to use this flat rounded brush. While I am going to add some shimmer and some sparkle on top of this, I want it to be a really bold pink. I don't want it to have the green in the back. Okay, you guys, so now I'm going to go into the King James book and I am going to use this rose gold-ish, pinkish color down here at the bottom. Yes, that's perfect. Rose gold. It's a rose gold color. So I'm going to use that on my lid. And should I, use, I could use this brush, but I'm going to use a different brush. I am going to use this small little brush, random brush. So I'm going to start off on a dry, um, dry brush and then I'm going to add the spray. Okay, I keep on moving my phone. Next, I'm gonna go into my hangover spray by Too Faced, and I'm gonna just spray it on my brush and get that extra pop out of my shipper. That's wrong. Okay, so I'm going to do it to the other side, and I'll be back. All right, so y'all know I'm going back into my goddess palette so that I could go ahead and contour the side of my eyes with those same green shades that your girl used earlier. Also gonna use my A Cosmetic Superhero. All right, y'all. So next I'm gonna go back into my Born This Way in the shade Butterscotch just to finish highlighting my face.
for my powder, I am going to use Fenty Beauty. I'm so sorry for all that noise. I know it is probably so annoying. But I'm going to use Fenty Beauty in the shade Honey. Next, I'm going to go into my MAC Medium Dark Contouring Kit. And I am going to be using the shade here. Okay, y'all, last but not least, I'm going to go into my, well, not last but not least, because I still need my lashes and my under, uh, under liner, but, okay, last but not least, um, <laughs> I said it again, I'm going to go in my Glow Kit by Anastasia Beverly Hills, and I am fenced to use Starburst, because my name is Star. <laughs> Okay, so now I'm going to use Protection um, Lip Liner. Well, really, this is eyeliner because it's black. But to under, uh, underline my eye.
I'm gonna add some of my Becca highlighter by my eye because it does not look like I put any there and I wanted to I wanted to have that shimmer y'all and I don't feel like pulling out all right hey okay okay next for lashes, y'all, I am going to be using Hallelujah. These lashes, see, I've been sleeping on these lashes. I don't know why I've been sleeping on these lashes, but it's like I'm just the type of person I get used. Look at them. They so bomb. I just get so used to doing the same thing, which I really have to come out of because now I technically have, I have had, Three collections of lashes, y'all. You know what I'm saying? Three, three, three. And it's just so emotional because I remember my first collection of lashes. They ain't even come with the boxes, Lord. I had to make the boxes myself. Um, and I remember I was like, you know what? I'm just going to thug it out. I'm going to go ahead and make it myself. And I made the design off of just, I don't know, we're just being creative. But I must say, while it may not have been the most appealing lash box, it means a lot to me because it was how do you say it? First of all, lashes were my first item that I decided to even sell. Second, the first thing that I bought for my collection. So it is definitely something I hold dear. But you know, even on top of that, it's like I made that with my hands. Like, come on, y'all. That was so fun. It was. And to move up to... <clears throat> so there we are yes y'all don't know how bad i want to start pulling out products from my next makeup collection because y'all know i'm gonna drop something on my birthday i just know i'm going to drop something on my birthday and i'm looking at it like oh my god i can't wait <laughs> but y'all don't know how bad i want to just pull it out Girl, she wants to pull it out so bad. I want to pull it out and use it so bad. And that's water. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and use this lipstick, which the... Uh, Okay, I'm going to put my hair on and I will be back. Oh, I wasted some water on me. That's okay. Okay, y'all. I am all done. What did y'all think? Do y'all like it? Am I getting back into my creative mode? Okay, back into my colorful, my loud, vibrant, popping colors that I love so much because I just have never been the uh, simple, neutral kind of girl. I'm just never, okay? Even having to wear uniforms in high school, this girl right here, I'm not doing, I'm finding every and any kind of way that I could get around the rules, that I could bend them rules, girl, okay? My classmates may not like me too much, but they will tell you that your girl was the fly every day. <laughs> Out of dress code every day. If I had attention, it was because I was out of dress code. <laughs> and was not caring. I came up there out of 
Yeah, I barely wore them uniforms. They had me messed up at that school. I was not finna wear. I waited. You know, I was like, I waited so long. I finna ask Miss Bray while I'm talking. I waited so long to get to high school to be able to wear what I want to wear. I was um, cause see, in middle school we had to wear uniforms too, of course, but. I would accessorize by wearing like a cute little undershirt that would match my thing for the day. Like I have a little pink undershirt and I wear my pink tennis shoes, with my pink purse and, you know, be looking cute. I'll be Miss Pink for the day and I will buy the button up shirts. So if I wanted to, I could just unbutton it and go, you know, if a teacher stopped me and say, ma'am, you're going to have to button that, button it. Walk past them, unbutton it back, and we go, okay? But in high school, I wore that little Lamar jacket, and I had whatever kind of shirt I felt like putting on underneath it. And when I passed up a teacher, I zipped that jacket up, walked past, unzipped my jacket, back out of uh, dress code. <laughs> <laughs> but after a while, everybody was doing that. But whatever. Whatever, y'all. Whatever. I just, I cannot conform. I like to be free. I like to be wild. How do y'all feel about that? I'm just going on a rant at this point. So I'm finna end this video. <laughs> I hope y'all enjoyed it. Um, Yeah, so I have to admit, I'm probably going to start posting different photo shoots of what I have on my website on queenpinboutique.com, uh, okay? So I'm going to be mixing that in with my March Madness because your girl did work really hard to do all them photo shoots. So I might as well go ahead and swing that in, okay? So love y'all. See y'all later. Two sis.